What is the value of the expression 7 squared minus 5 plus 4? Insert the parentheses, then multiply by 5 minus 2, insert the parentheses again. Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? This expression is very deceptive and 99% of people get the wrong answer. Let's take a closer look and solve it together. And the first step to solve this question, many people usually go straight to the exponent and write the whole expression as 49 minus 5 plus 4, insert the parentheses, then multiply by 5 minus 2, insert the parentheses again. Then they go to the first parentheses and instead of this expression, they write 49 minus 9, multiply by 5 minus 2, insert the parentheses. And the next step, they go for the subtraction between 49 and 9, which I have highlighted in yellow. And instead of this expression, they write 40 multiplied by 5 minus 2 inside the parentheses. And the final step, they simplify the expression inside the parentheses and replace it with 40 multiplied by 3, which finally gives them the answer 120. And immediately, they quickly say that the correct answer to this question is option D. However, it's not the correct answer to this question. Alright, now let me show you how to solve this expression properly. As you can see on the screen, and this expression, first we have an exponent, then a subtraction sign, after that we have parentheses, followed by a multiplication sign, and finally another parentheses. To solve this question, we must strictly follow the PEMDAS row, and this row, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. We must perform all the operations in this expression exactly according to the PEMDAS rule in order from top to bottom. So, we must stop with the parentheses first, because according to the PEMDAS rule, parentheses have the highest priority compared to the other operations. Okay, Instead of this expression, we can write 7 squared minus 9 multiply by 3. And the next step, we need to go to the exponent, because in the PEMDAS rule, after parentheses, exponent has a higher priority than the other operations. So, this expression simplifies to 49 minus 9 multiply by 3. And the final step, it's time for the multiplication between 9 and 3, because multiplication has a higher priority than subtraction. So, we write this expression as 49 minus 27, which ultimately gives us the answer 22. That's great. Option C is the correct answer to this question. Alright, now let's solve another tricky math question together. What is the value of the expression 45 divided by 15 multiplied by open parentheses 60 divided by 10 close parentheses? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? Let's go step by step and solve it together. Many people, when starting to solve this question, first focus on the expression inside the parentheses, and instead of considering the whole expression, they write it as 45 divided by 15 multiplied by 6. And the next step, they go for the multiplication between 15 and 6, because they believe multiplication has a higher priority than division. So, they simplify this expression and write it as 45 divided by 90, which finally gives them the answer 0.5. Then, they conclude that the correct answer to this question must be option A. However, this answer is absolutely wrong. Alright, now let me explain the surprise of how to solve this expression correctly. To solve this question, we need to follow the PEMDAS rule step by step. We must carry out these operations strictly in order from top to bottom. Alright, as you can see on the screen, and this expression, first we have a division sign, then a multiplication sign, and finally parentheses. According to the PEMDAS rule, we must start with the parentheses first, because parentheses have the highest priority compared to the other operations. So, we can write this expression as 45 divided by 15 multiplied by 6. Now, we need to perform the division and multiplication. However, it's very important to keep in mind that multiplication and division are on the same level of precedence. In this case, the best approach is to start from the left and carry out these two operations in order. So, first we handle the division between 45 and 15, which simplifies this expression to 3 multiplied by 6. And finally, the answer becomes 18. Therefore, option C is the correct answer to this question.